I believe we are back live almost immediately after last stream. This is going to be going up on YouTube. So from our YouTube audience, aloha kakahiaka means good morning to you. Aloha kakahiaka, ohaya gozaimasu, sao shenghao, and good morning to my jams and jellies. My name is Jelly Jimmy Jam. Welcome back to another video and welcome back to another stream. We are doing the grind one after the other. Hell yeah. I'm going to get some water because I was streaming for an entire hour and I haven't had any water. Bad me. Alright. We just finished three quests last video, last stream. So we're going to be doing Professor Hecate's class assignment. So we're going to learn Expelliarmus, but first I have to get to that class. Do I know how to get there from here? No, I don't. So. Lost to a new student. Hmm. I didn't see that coming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The best duelist won, I suppose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, Sebastian. Sorry. Okay, we are going straight to Defense Against the Dark Arts. Oh, wait, wrong way. This should be nearby. Uh, sorry, sir. That was a little too late for me. Am I going the right way? I don't think I am. How do I get there? I hate following this map. It always gets me lost. Then again, I probably should have been following that dot. Go figure. Oh, wait, wait. Incendio. Thank you. Let's see if we can get to level 14 in this stream slash video. Wait, did I pass it again? Are you serious? I swear to god, if I get lost, I'm gonna flu powder my way there. Uh, turn! I really need to memorize where everything is. Oh, good, there it is. Is it nighttime? Oh no, daytime. Leander Imelda, I think that's her name. What is his name? I meet him in flying class. And there's Poppy, sweet Poppy, Professor Hecate. There's the Bastion. See, if Sebastian and Poppy can be friends, why can't he and I date? Boo. <laughs> this game needed a romance. I hope you were able to take care of everything. Professor, I completed all of your most recent assignments. Well done. Then you're ready to learn Expelliarmus. Pay close attention. The disarming charm may often be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter. Okay. Spell casting requires a focused mind and a steady Harry Potter's mind. favorite spell to use. Expelliarmus. Good. Mummy is here if you wish to stay in practice. There we go. Expelliarmus. You seem to have a You can keep practice. Expelliarmus may save your life. Nice. Okay, we're all good. I know how to use Expelliarmus. It's one of my favorite spells to use. Alright, moving on. I don't want to start this one yet because I'd rather wait till I get Alohomora, technically speaking. Let's go to Herbology class. We're gonna meet Professor Garlic. Nice. 
Let me in. Let me in. They're cute. Well, that's the thing is, his base is literally cool because all the fucking pets is it's blocking the game. Also, I apologize if you hear swearing behind me. That would be the roommate Ikaika. Let me out. Thank you. Turn. This game is a little funky to operate. Or do the plants perk up when Professor Garlic? Ooh, there's stuff for me to get. Yay! Gimme, 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 gimme. Gimme! Oh? I don't like snooping, but that's meant for me. Okay, let's start class. Ooh, we're playing with mandrakes today. Good morning, Professor Garlic. How wonderful it is to see you again, Lenora dear. Oh, here. You'll need these for today's class. Uh, um, uh, A little treat for your auntie. That's so cute. Class, please welcome the newest rose in our garden. I should have worn our uniform. Hi, Sebastian. Why are you looking at me like that? Together. Why, why are you looking at me How like that? How thrilling it is to have everyone back together again. This year will be filled with enchantment and excitement, but the most important thing cultivated in herbology is knowledge. The prudent herbologist is no more afraid of the venomous tentacular than the bouncing bone. Now then, today we will be acquainting ourselves with the mellifluous tuber known as the mandrake root. Back here. My favorite part of the Chamber Let's of Secrets. Let's see if we can't make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? First, let's protect our ears. Now, everyone, Oh, I like that sound design. That she's muffled. Tug. Sorry, no, no worries. We're just in herbology class. We were messing around with some mandrakes. Like Thank you for coming back. I appreciate you. Putting the mandrake right at ease. Repair. That was Professor Garlic. I'm very sorry about that. Yours was a bit mature, I'm afraid. All right then, off you go. Splendid work, everyone. I like your breed. Now for our next task, we'll be planting dittany at our potting tables. You can all get started. I need to have a brief word with our new student. Okay. Hello. Hmm. I wonder if hippogriffs like not grass. Oh, Poppy is so cute. Poppy yes, loves Professor. animals and beasts. Firstly, well done with your mandrake. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. Actually, I enjoyed it. I couldn't help but catch her enthusiasm. How kind of you. It seems you're already taking to herbology like a mandrake to fresh soil. Now, as I mentioned, next we'll be planting dittany. Let us find you some seeds. I already have some, Professor. Picked them up in Hogsmeade. You visited the Magic Neep. Wonderful! A prepared student is bound to bloom. I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here in the classroom. It wasn't easy to spare one on such late notice. Plant the seeds there now, and you can return to harvest them later. Even with soil, sunlight, and a bit of magic, they will take time to grow. Let's see how to balance my star thistle arrangement. Mifflers fancy, or roses? Yay, I have a potting table. Well 
Yay. done. Once it can be harvested, your Dittany will be ready to use in Wiganweld Potion. I'll let Professor Sharp tell you about that. Professor Sharp is now, in charge of so potions. Branch out. Introduce <gasps> Yay, you to Chinese chopping cabbage. Sort of I love flora. the Chinese chopping cabbage. Chinese it's so great. Chinese chopping cabbage. You'll find that some plants are better suited to uses outside of a cauldron. The cabbages do get testy without something to chew. Fortunately, I have a dummy for them to gnaw on. Dear, dear, and let them have a good chomping. Yes, Professor. They're in the other greenhouse. It's just at the end of the footbridge leading out of this room. Your classmate, Mr. Pruitt, has kindly offered to accompany you. Ah, Leander. Come back and see me when you're finished. Oh, and mind your fingers. They do bite. A garden requires. Hello. Saw you on your way to Hogsmeade the other day. Nice to meet you. I'm Leander. I'll You're be showing also you the Chinese cute. chomping cabbages. Up these stairs will take us there. But your lead. You know, I feel a little out of place. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna. I feel out of place. I feel out of place. I. I. Where? Oh, where? Perfect. Now I can fit in. I felt a little out of place. I have such a thing for nice gingers. work in defense against the dark arts, by the way. Excuse me? Your duel with Sebastian. And he's good. <laughs> Thinks he's really good. But you outright slaughtered him. It was brilliant. Oh, well, thank you. I nearly put Sebastian in his place myself. I mean, I would have. If Hecate hadn't stopped me. Didn't she stop that dragon skull from crushing you? <sighs> Typical Slytherin trick, dropping a dragon skull on someone during a fight. We Gryffindors fight with honor. And uh, Hufflepuffs too. At least you did. Thanks. Here we are. Home of the Chinese chomping cabbage. Now, see that dummy? Just toss the cabbages at it. I want all of them. Be the rest. I'm greedy. Wait, there was a thingy. Was there not? Am I nuts? I guess I am nuts, all right. So these are the Chinese chomping cabbage. I absolutely love the Chinese chomping cabbage because here we go. Get him! Look at that! I'm trying to make they can get, get their uh, mouths on. <laughs> Mum planted some in her garden last year to keep the gnomes out. Hey, aren't they Did just the cutest? The moment, but they left their honking Look daffodils at them. in tatters. Hello! Vicious little bastards, aren't they? <laughs> My kind of plants. Not like stupid booba tubers and bouncing bulbs. The kind of plants that just have your back in a fight. I'm not saying you can't go it alone, but well, imagine that wasn't a dummy. I suppose they could prove useful yeah, outside of the greenhouse. Like Nothing wrong with a bit of backup, even if it is from a cabbage. It's chaos out there. Trolls and hogsmeade and such. You can't be oh, above yeah, throwing a cruciferous vegetable if necessary. Dogweed and death cap has more of them, if you're keen. Other plants too. Ones your parents wouldn't plant in the garden. Oh. You get the idea. Anyway, we uh, probably ought to head back to class. Take your time. I'll see you back in class. Okay. Okay, that's where you guys are. Rebellion. Still just fucking this weird. Oh no, I hear it. Why am I 
Why must it be so annoying? Uh, forget it. I said I would only claim them if they made themselves visible to me. That was my rule with the uh, field guide pages. Unless I see them gleaming at me, I am not going to um, pursue them. Every day. Yeah. And with that helpful reminder as to why we should always wear our dragon hide gloves, I shall end our lesson here. Hey. Are you done yet? Sorry, Mr. No, you're barely halfway done. I'll, I'll keep my own. I attended to the Chinese chomping cabbages, Professor. Remarkable plants, aren't they? I hope they weren't too much trouble. Oh, so, don't see any bite marks or missing digits. And good, as you yeah, do seem to be awesome. quite green-fingered. Oh, I'm eager to see your skill in the soil continue to blossom. Magical plants have so much to offer. I'm eager to learn more. I'm glad. Herbology is a bounteous subject. Tend to your garden, and it will tend to you. Huh. Well, I suppose that's everything. Do come by for a chat sometime. I so enjoy checking in with my new students. Will do. It's a relief to finally have an answer as to why that portrait was empty. Really Almost thirteen. Almost. Only cost me my. Damn. All right. Moving on. We only have this mission to do. Because the Dedalian keys again. I'm not gonna do that one. That one is so much effort. All right. Here we go. Because I don't have a broom, I have to walk this. Or That's run it. I'm out there for anybody to pick up. I have no Let me in! Let me in! Thank you. And let me out. I, I'm, it's a very fat fucking Ah! Stop it! Stop it! Oh my gosh! Petty little dude, aren't you? Whispered humming. Oh lordy. <laughs> that was unexpectedly violent. But kind of funny, the way that he was so petty he had to go back and kick him again. And again. Let's go for a nice long walk outside, everybody. hate long walks. Yep, so unfortunately that's what you're going to have to look forward to with this game. Um, if you look at my older streams, I have another account that I was playing. She is level 33. That's Jamie Pendragon. This is Jamie Wolfric. Jamie Wolfric, um, these streams are going to go straight to YouTube. So that is why I don't know where I'm going. Where is my character taking me? Anyways. Um, yeah. You'll get a broom much later, but until then, unfortunately, we have to meet Natty. Um, quite a ways away, obviously speaking. So this is what you have to look forward to. We have to take a nice long walk all the way over here. It looks short. I assure you it's not. So at least this is early on in the game. You don't have to do much running afterwards because again, you'll have a broom. Or you could always flu um, powder it. I hope I'm going the right way. Rebellion. Moonstones. Those are going to be useful to you later as well. Uh, oh, leaping toadstool caps. Thank you.
Of course, as any game goes, whenever you see ingredients, collect them. You're gonna need them. It also- the same goes for, um, why are they giving me Wigan Wood potions? It probably means that there's a battle coming up and you're gonna need all the health potions you need. Revenia. Oh, those balloons floating in the background are what you have to pop when you do get your balloon. In case you missed it, you'll probably see it when I go walk around again. Oh, the famous wooden bridge. Ugh, I love when Professor Lupin was there with Harry. Such a good shot. Alright, here we go. Yeah, these balloons you're gonna have to pop with your broom. I can't wait to get my broom. This is torture. Chicken! Hello, chicken. Avenia. I heard it. But where is it? Hello, I'm here to rob you. I apologize. Wait, is it in here? It is. Groundskeeper's tools. One might surmise that this set of tools could it's be enchanted to create all sorts of furnishings for a cozy hut, as large as the occupant may need. Oh, yay! Level 13! Can we do one more? I think we can. I should investigate. Investigate what? Investigate what? What does that mean? This is just a general question, like, would you think that they did, do you think they should, or should Gimme, 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 thank you. Rebellion. Okay, I can't do, I know what that quest is, I'll start it, but I'm not gonna activate it because I don't have any room in my slots for my gear, that's what I've been dressing myself in for my stats. I need to talk to... Is there a vendor I can speak to? <sighs> it is good to see you, my friend. It is good to see you too, Natty. I appreciate you so very much. Ooh, I love doing his mission because that means I get to fight. I never thought Ramrock's loyalists would go this far. I know, Mr. Arn. I know. Hello. Hello, sir. What do you sell here? Hello. I'm Jalal Semi, and this is my potion shop. I can answer any questions you have about the town. Okay. What do you sell? What do you have for sale? I sell only potions and their ingredients. If you can't fix it with a potion, then it's best left broken, I say. <laughs> my ingredients are all local to this area, and my potions are brewed to keep you healthy and safe. Who are you? Can you tell me a bit about yourself? Oh, let's see. Well, I am Lower Hogsfield's preeminent potioneer. But I was once a lowly Hogwarts student like you. In fact, I'll give you the Hogwarts discount. The standard yeah, it's price. It's the standard price. That's fine. My prices are low enough already, you see. All right. Um, any rumors? Any whispers going about the town? There's a thief on the loose by the name of Katrin Haggerty. She's an ashwinder. She's stealing everything that's not nailed down, and people have had enough. Katrin's hiding in a camp just southwest of town. Hmm. And what do you have for sale? Yes, what do you have for sale, sir? No, I already got those. All right. Goodbye. I'll goodbye. have no trouble selling this. Goodbye. Thank you. And goodbye. 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 No thank you. No thank you. No thank you. No thank you. Appreciate this. And goodbye. Yay. Did he just flip over, like, my grandma? Ah, yes. A wonderful choice. I try to buy what I can. <laughs> Alright. Oh, wait. Before I start that mission, is this who I think it is? Hello. Hello. 
Is it too early for this? It is too early for this. Drat. So this lady who's here, um, she's the one who starts the Merlin trials, which is why I need the Mallow Suite. But seeing that, I do not have any of that. This girl wants me to go diving in the Black Lake, which sounds like a horrifying idea, and it is. It scares the living life out of me to go... Huh? What's Hello? wrong? <laughs> Can I help What's wrong? you? Oh, thank goodness. Yes. You okay there? My name is Grace Pinch Also, how Smedley. do I pronounce your of handle? I don't want to mispronounce Smedley's? it. I was hoping someone would come along soon. I was about to defy my father's wishes and would never have forgiven myself. You see, I need to retrieve you sold everything. I have to. Of the lake. Unfortunately, you have to. You be the one to. As an me? Animal Crossing player, it hurts my heart to sell stuff. Diving but into the lake you only like have so much space Tell to get more. new gear Splendid. that you're kind of forced to sell Precisely everything. the response I'd hoped for. What do you need help Unfortunately. with? Unfortunately, years ago, my grandfather, who fancied himself quite the astronomer, Melina. set sail from Hogsmeade Melina, Station for Melina. what was meant to be okay. a quick stargazing cruise. With Thank my you, Melina. Where are you chatting from, by the way, if you don't mind me returned. asking? I'm so sorry. What happened to them? We can't be sure. We I am streaming from Hawaii. They nor their boat made it back to shore. They were presumed drowned. Father was so distraught that he forbade our family from setting foot on or in the Black Lake ever again. A treasured family astrolabe vanished with them that night. If you could dive down and retrieve it, I may be able to bring my father some peace. All right. Um. What exactly is an astrolabe? It's an astonishing ancient navigational tool. I do not wish to specify this information. All right, thank you. Of the universe. That's why you don't it's have to specify that. For thank you. The stars, astronomical pursuits, but it has nearly a thousand uses. Fascinating device. Sadly, I'd imagine it's rusted beyond repair now. Still, we'd love to have it. I wonder if the Earth. PS5 it version of the game that you download is different than my version. I got mine on the Nintendo Switch. I had to pre-order it, unfortunately, so I didn't get it till recently. Why would I know of your family? That's like I wonder if there's any the big differences blue, between platforms. Is green. The Pinch Smedley name is synonymous with intellectual curiosity. We are known for our contributions to science and art. I'm surprised you haven't heard of us, frankly. Yeah, but I'm wondering if my I character is Muggleborn or something, because I don't seem to know a lot about the magical the world. Those that don't know the name certainly one day will. Yeah, I'm either Muggleborn or my parents are squibs, because I don't know why my character doesn't know a lot about the Muggle or, or not the Muggle world, the magical world. It sounds dangerous, especially for something of mere sentimental value. I understand. But okay, I'd be we are going to go grateful. swimming in the Black Lake. Of course, I you don't may like this mission. I live on an island, but Anything else you found I don't like thinking of things that I, you know, I cross can't the vessels see. Last I feel location. uncomfortable when my feet can't lake touch the floor when I'm in the ocean. And tai My best guess is that it's just over there. Pretty sure she said she was waiting to go from the docks. Hmm. It would be wonderful to have my grandfather's well, actually laid back. Your character doesn't start Hogwarts until you're 15 years you old because you come to Hogwarts. It so much to our family. It sounds as if her astrolabe is just northeast of the dock. I should dive down and see. Dive in the Black Lake. I hate this. Yes, I would like this one faster. I don't like this at all. Yeah, so your character, male or female, does not matter. They um, get their acceptance letter to Hogwarts at 15, so. It's interesting we can't visit parents. Yeah, it is. There's a lot of things this in this. This must be oh, where the pinch God. smedley family astrolabe is. Eh. Eh. Eh, dive. God. Even though he visits Sebastian's uncle? Yep, I agree. It is very odd. I should let Grace know that I found her family astrolabe. How did I find it so fast? I want more gear. I sold stuff for this. Let's see. There's nothing else for me? Boo. 
I think she's Muggleborn. Yeah, that might make sense since we don't know anything about the magical world. God, this is horrifying. It's getting dark too. I don't like that. Not at all. Oh wait, the shore's over there. Swim faster, please. It's getting dark. Oh god, the light's turned on. Ugh. I do not fancy a visit from... Why is that area? Gimme. Grace, I got your family's doohickey. I trust you didn't find the dive too terribly difficult. Nah. Hello, Grace. I followed your bearings on a dive in the Black Lake. Oh, how incredible! Did you find the astrolabe? I did, here you go. I did. I hope it makes your father happy. It will. I can't wait to see his face. Thank you so much for doing this for me. And for my family. Of course. You do well to keep an eye out for more spots to dive. A diver of your caliber is certain to find all sorts of things down there. Is there a map? Like, is there a Thank diving map? Again. Because I don't want to, like, blindly just go back and you forth in have the lake. For finding treasure. Understandably so, you know. Oh, I got a mermaid mask. That's pretty cool. Ooh. I hope we get to interact with mermaids. I do like mermaids. <sighs> It is good to see you, my friend. I know, Natty. I'm sorry. Just one more mission, I promise. I never thought Ramrock's loyalists would go this far. Hello, Pardon Mr. Arn. Is everything all right? Hardly. I've just lost my business and almost my life. You'd best look elsewhere for wares. I've nothing to sell now. I never thought it'd come to this. Be on your guard. Ramrock and his loyalists will spare no one. They attacked you. Oh, Ranrock has no patience for goblins who won't join him. While I too would like to see goblin kind treated by wizards as equals, bloodshed is not the answer. I'll treat when you I like said an as equal. much, they turned on me, struck me till I nearly passed out. Took my carts, my belongings, even that which is most precious to me, my paintings. He's just an artist. You mentioned that your paintings were taken. Are you a painter? I am. It's my calling. Though most would think it an unusual path for a goblin, most of my family work in metal or associated with Gringotts. I'd wager my finest brush that Ramrock's lot have no appreciation for any of my work and it will be tossed aside for kindling. Without my carts and my livelihood, who knows when I'll be able to paint again. Has Ramrock's lot ever attacked you like this before? They've been taunting and threatening me for a while now. They've always believed that violence is the only way to get what they want. Things have taken a much darker turn of late. Ramrock is getting more powerful, and his loyalists know it. They feel untouchable. Ramrock assumed that all goblins would agree to follow him. But he was wrong. Many of us would like a diplomatic end to the discord with wizard kind. I'm sorry this happened to you. I shall certainly keep an eye out for your carts. That is very kind of you, but I think they took them to their camp southwest of here, just past some ruins. Too dangerous to try and retrieve them. Challenge I did accepted. enchant the carts to return to me if I ever lost them, however. Slim though the chances may be, I'm holding out hope that some of what was taken is returned to me. It was nice meeting you. I wish it had been under better circumstances. It is good to see you, my friend. Alright, finally time for Natty. I'm sorry. Hello, Natty. How are you? I am well, thank you. I was there, and I saw what happened with Rookwood and Harlow at the Three Broomsticks. I have been worried about you. I'm alright at the moment. If you don't mind my asking, why were they looking for you? They want something that Professor Fig and I found at Gringotts. When were you at Gringotts? Just before we came to Hogwarts. In fact, it's why I was late to the sorting ceremony. A port key brought us there after the dragon attacked our carriage. What on earth? There's one more thing. It's a bit odd, if I'm honest. 
Professor Fig says I have a rare connection to a powerful form of ancient magic. I... What does that mean? I don't I'm know what that means here, either, girl. I can see traces of it. And I've cast magic I can't otherwise explain. I know that's a lot to absorb. It is. And I will have more questions. For now, it is safe to say that Rookwood and Harlow are a threat to both of us. To all of us. Which is why I wanted to speak to you. Everyone has been talking about you defending Hogsmeade from that troll attack. And I shall never forget watching Serona stand up to Rookwood and Harlow in the Three Broomsticks. Both of you have inspired me to take a stand of my own. What sort of stand? Men like Rookwood and Harlow are the reason my mother and I left Matibili land. I am not going to sit by and watch them destroy my new home. Good. Rookwood and Harlow are a dangerous pair. And you should know that Rookwood is in league with Ranrock. I had heard they were seen in Hogsmeade together. All the more reason they must be stopped. Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day operations. Taking him down would cripple Rookwood's entire enterprise. That may be true, but shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like Harlow? I spoke with her. She was polite, but perhaps understandably would not discuss details with a student. I overheard some of Rookwood's lot talking about a massive poaching operation that Harlow is planning. I was thinking that we could investigate a bit, try to get the evidence that Officer Singer needs. All right. But how? I am going to watch and listen and find out precisely what Harlow is up to. I shall reach out when I know more. In the meantime, remember, I am here if you need me. I love Thank Natty. You, Natty. And that was it. Be on your guard. Sorry. What are you up to now? I beg your pardon! How dare you threaten me? What's going on here? Alright. Help the stranger. I'm on my way. I'm coming, lady. I'm coming to help you. I'm running as fast as I can. I promise I'm running as fast as I can. Come in. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Fight. Win. Come here. I have no idea who it is you think I might have seen. I've been busy with my research. I do not have time to- Victor Rookwood don't give a doxy's nip back your time. Oi! Speak of the devil. A bit of a divvy. Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. Leave a the lady student. alone. You can't be sick. <laughs> Come here. Leave her alone. There. Alright, we're fighting. Perfect. Target practice. <laughs> That's probably the fastest duel I've ever done. I spoke too soon. Oh, watch the light go out of your eyes. Sure. Try me. We can hold them up. I'm not going anywhere. You take Yay. What on earth just happened? I've never been accosted in such a manner. Then so close to Hogwarts. I'm so sorry this happened to you, ma'am. Are you all right? I am, thanks in no small part to your excellent defensive skills. Care to tell you why two Ashwinders were ready to dispatch me to get to you? Ashwinders? Victor Rockwood, thieves and extortionists, his little cronies. They seemed quite keen on you. It's a long story, but thank you for your help. Hmm. Well, you've avoided them for the moment. Priya warned me things were getting dangerous. Best get moving on my research before they return. You mentioned someone named Priya. Yes, my wife. Hmm. She's the one who piqued my interest in Merlin. Gave me a book when we were students at We Hogwarts. support the LGBTQIA+. Brilliant potioner. Has her own shop in Nocturne Alley. She's a traveling vendor. Here's what's going on in the Highlands before I do. You're a researcher. Nora Treadwell at your service. Historian and archaeologist specializing in Merlin's work and life. Marlin? Of the legend of King Arthur? The very same. 
Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know, and I'm studying some curious fixtures he left here centuries ago. Fixtures? These vine covered I wonder. I kind of want to mess with my lights for a bit. around the area. I've taken to calling them the Trials of Merlin. I believe he created them as a diversion for yeah. his fellow Slytherins. <laughs> he was terribly fond of puzzles and enigmas. I can see why you're so interested in Merlin. I'd be keen to know more about the trials. Well then, I'll let you in on a little secret. No one has yet managed to figure out how they work. But I believe I have just unlocked a crucial clue. I suspect that Mallow Sweet is an important component in getting the trials to work. Mallow Sweet? Versatile herb. Merlin repeatedly mentioned it in his writings. I had just arrived to test my theory when I was so rudely interrupted. <laughs> you see, each swirl in Merlin's writing has its symbol in you the center. You can't see it, but I have RGB. That started me thinking. Swirling. What if Mallow Sweet is meant to be placed at the center of the symbols? Precisely. Would you care to do the honors? There we, we go. can see what comes of our little hypothesis. Sorry, ADHD there. I brought right. a trunk chock full of Mallow Sweet with me. It's just over there by my tent. Um. Ah. Give me, give me, give me. Yes, take plenty, even if you already have some. Sure, ma'am. I have wow, Mallow thank Sweet. you. Lovely. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here, as well as a stone swell on the ground. Each trial has these features. Place the Mallow Sweet on the swell, and we'll see what happens. Okay. My word! Did you see that? The vines disappeared! What should I do now? Hmm, this is uncharted territory. Incendiary! The flames make the fire sink. Started. Wasn't there supposed to be a fourth one? No? What did I do wrong? Excuse me, ma'am. Incendio! Is that it? Oh, did I miss the middle one? Whoops. Great, beautiful. What a day. I can hardly believe. I take it we can call that a success. We can indeed. However, I now have even more questions. How does it work? Oh, the Merlin I'm trials are interesting. Rings. I may have missed something. Are uh, all of the There's a lot of trials. Hmm? Oh, not precisely. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swell on the ground. You should feel free to solve them as you come across them. I believe I have what I need to continue my research. My guess is that each will also require mallow suit, which you can find in Hogsmeade should you need more. I really must be off. Such a pleasure to meet you. All right. And do be careful out here. Now, I've got what I needed. I shall return to the safety of my notes and books. As you deserve, ma'am. If you're here for my words, Rebellion. After what Van Rock did to that goblin banker at Gringos, I shouldn't be surprised at what happened to Orn.
Hello, I am casually here to rob you. I apologize. Rebellion. Okay. Let's see. I have 15 minutes left. What shall I do? Potions? Or fighting? I'd say we fight after I put on better gear. Oh, shucks. I have to be level 14. What about you? I have to be level 14. And you? <gasps> Ouch, level 14. No, I like that one better. Okay. Oh wait, <laughs> sorry. I keep forgetting to check my challenges. Challenges. Exploration. Merlin Trials. Exciting. Combat. Exciting. Alright, let's go fight. Alright, we're going to the goblin camp. Hopefully this isn't going to be too difficult for me. Considering I am. Oh yeah, it's far away because you don't have a broom. Anything in yellow is for you to collect. Anything in red is an enemy and blue means use magic. Hello? What the hell was that? Rebellion. <sighs> What's there? What's there? Rebellion. What is that? Oh, it's cows. Oh, spiders. Melina, do you like spiders? Where's the other one? Oh, you're behind me. What? No spider fang? Uh, Boo. Like Who does? Uh, I don't. I will actively avoid them. But... The only reason why I didn't is because I needed to level up. Because for some reason... I need to be level 14 to wear my new gear. So either I progress too fast or I need more EXP. Or XP, I should say. Oh, this is cute. Rebellion. Oh, look, more spiders. Hebr Hebridean black scale. The Hebridean black is a large dragon that can grow no, no. to over nine uh, meters in length. A large rough scale, originally belonging to one of these beasts, is one of the prized possessions that Archie Bickle keeps in his hideout. We're doing a little bit of investigation. Look, there's two more spiders. Let's go get them. Hey, there's my spider fang. Eight legs is simply too many. Wait, where'd it go? Rebellion. Oh, I had a prize. Do I not get my spider fangs yet? Boo. We were just going off of a suspicion that has absolutely no evidence, but... Mm. Ooh, a dog. I'm sorry, not a dog. A dark mongrel. Mm. Ooh, I know this Merlin trial. Oh, yeah. 
Could it be a Merlin trial? Level 14. Do you guys still have one engine in your base right now? Boo. Rebellia. What's here? Check, check the front. Ooh. A dog. So there's a red here right now. Stupid fire. Rebellia. Incendio. Stupid fire. We're trying to do it sneakily though, so they don't count. Yes! Alright. Now that I am level 14, I am going to change into my gear before I run Guns Blaze and Wand set into a goblin camp where I'm going to be surrounded by Ran Rock's loyalists that are going to try to kill me. Smashing stuff. Hello, beautiful big cow. You look absolutely stunning. I wish I could pet you. What? What? Where did you come from? There's so many of them. Okay, um, new plan. I kind of want to get into that fight. Once I get better gear on, that is. Oh, look at that. Woohoo! My offense and defense are the same. That will rarely happen in the future. Up 11. Up 2. I think I want to be up 11. <laughs> Wouldn't you? <laughs> Alright, let's go fight a big batch of baddies. Helps my confidence a bit. Alright, level 14. Let us fight. Oh boy. I'm gonna run straight on in. While I have that adrenaline in me. An encampment? This must be it. Looks as if there's more than one way to enter. There should be liquid transportations uh, that will, uh, that will I know I heard something that time. Yeah, 
Yeah, sure I will. reach. And up we go. Lovely. Rebellion. Got it. Enchantment. The yeah. cards are returning to on. Good. As they should. I know what that means. Merlin trial. Let's do this. This one is an easy one. All you need is Accio. Last one is outside. Another Merlin trial down. Alright, we got quite a bit done today, and I am so happy that we've reached my ideal level, which was Rebellion. level 14. I want the bag. Good. 
Keep you airborne. Oh, more of you. How fun. Now is that it? Head on back to Arn, and we can probably call stream slash video there. Or should we do one more quest? So that way we wrap things up nicely. I think we could do one more quest. Let's do potions, seeing that it's daytime now. Ugh, God, such walking. Hi, Pajama says, how are you? What the hell? Why? Why? Um, I want you. Yay. Hi, Pajama says, how are you? Thank you for stopping by. I appreciate you. The penguin is super cute. I hope you're having a good Wednesday or Thursday, depending where you are in the world. We were just discussing having to do another quest, which I'm most likely going to do. Hope you had an amazing New Year's. Still Wednesday for me. Oh, hello, hello. Ah, Toshiro Chicken. Hello, hello. I did have an amazing New Year's. What about you? I was walking into a tree. I apologize. It is also Wednesday for me. It is currently 7.15 p.m. Oh, it's a little bunny. I have good news. Your carts are on their way back. Oh, I, don't, I don't know what to say. Any hope I have of getting my belongings back was quickly fading. Ramrock's lot called me a fool for believing it's like in the good It's like 9pm Wednesday for me. It's cold though. Thank you for proving me I wrong. think it's rather hot today. I managed to free your carts fairly easily. But that's what happens I'm when you live on an island right. in the tropics. Oh, I can't wait to have my things back, especially my paints. <gasps> You know, you've How's your day going? Me. It is going. I mean, slowly but surely going. We've always got along just the island fine. life, <laughs> yeah. My next I will admit, will anything below 7 degrees is rather cold for us. us. Like, anything below 70 degrees, we're wearing sweats, we're wearing hoodies, and we're wearing socks with our slippers. What a nice idea, Ron. I wish you luck with it. Oh, I can't wait to get started. Uh, thank you again for all you've done. All right, let us do one more quest. All the best to you. Once my cars arrive, I'd be happy to show you my ways. All right, let's do one more quest. It's daytime. I don't want to miss out on anything. We're going to do potions class, and then we're going to complete light, live as a student. And I think that's going to be a great way to end this video. This, sorry, this stream is going to end up on YouTube because I needed to make more content. And this is the content that I've currently been working on outside of YouTube because I haven't filmed anything yet. I'm in the process of filming more. Oh, level 15. Doesn't matter, it's junk. Did you have a nice New Year's? Let's go sell all of this and make some moolah. Ugh, 
Ooh, more storage space. That's great. Oh, I guess I'm in the highlands. Alright, now time for a long walk back to the castle. Yay. I'd rather walk, to be completely honest. Oh, I got four more slots open. Exciting. Oh wait, I was supposed to go sell stuff. Turn around. Let's bring this baby back one more time. Is that a switcher in the basement now? Hello, Mr. Sir. I would like to settle my stuff. Hello, Mr. Semi. What can I do for you? Yeah. What do you have for sale? Gimme, 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 oh, gimme. Moving on to potions. I'm not sure how I'd fare in a little place like this. I don't think I'd fare very well. Uh, was I wrong? Was this century of public? All right, or, here we go. Okay. Okay. There I really want to go through the wooden bridge. To be completely honest with you. That bridge, yes. They went to go to the bridge. That was my favorite scene in Prisoner of Azkaban. And also so sad that they broke it in the Battle of Hogwarts. <laughs> yeah, I get to go through the wooden bridge. Draco Malfoy gets punched here. Ha ha ha. Hello! Wow. Wow. Moving on. Oh, hello. Revelio. Reveal yourself to me and I will claim you. The Well of Four Bees. Some students believe that a wish made over the Well of Four Bees, whether near the Thestral Griffin, Chimera, or Hippogriff, will come true for those who has gained the trust of any of the four. for me? No? Okay. Alright, let me in. <laughs> Sorry, adjusting myself in my seat. I don't have to pulse though. Oh wait, am I going the wrong way? Like actually? Alright, let's try to follow the map for once. The map usually puts me in the wrong place. Or changes its mind halfway through. Well, let's try to trust the map. See? Look, it changed its mind again. Ugh. Why do I trust you? You know what? I don't have time for this. <laughs> going the right way, I think. Uh, who knows?
Is it two pinches of Angelica? Or... Shouldn't there be auras or someone from the Ministry guarding the school after the incident in Hogsmeade? Professor Black would never allow that. It would make him look completely incompetent, which he is. Eh. I'm just going to intrude on your privacy, Professor. Give me that, and give me that. Anything else in here for me? Yes. Rebellion. Um. Thank you. Rebellion. Where are you? There you are. Hiding. Okay, Professor Sharp's Aura Badge. Auras comp comprise the Ministry's magical law enforcement and protect the wizarding world from all sorts of threats, particularly those posed by dark magic. This Aura Badge belongs to Professor Sharp. Oh, former Aura. Anything else? No? Alright, moving on. Let us do this quest and complete live as a student. How you like this game? I like it very much, to be completely honest. Oh, my two favorite boys are over there together. Hmm, Sebastian and Gareth. Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld Potion. Mr. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion might come in handy. Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wiganwell potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Points for Ravenclaw. Hmm. Before today's class is completed, each of you will have brewed a Wiganwell potion of your own. You never know when you might need it. Please begin. I love this game. My other account is level 33. This um, character, Jamie Wolfric, she is going to be streaming Use strictly for YouTube. When crushing your ingredients. So all of these streams that have Jamie Wolfric One are going to go to YouTube. Could be disastrous. I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Hmm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. And from what I hear of your recent exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain, and will require you to be a bit more resourceful. Come and see me when you've finished brewing, and we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time around. Professor Sharp said that Wiganweld potion can treat injuries. Hope I never need it. Don't fret if you run out of ingredients. Yeah, I simply grow most of what I need. I'm... My parents considered keeping me home from school this year after the rumors of a goblin rebellion. I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office. Hello, Weasley. Yes, but why does that matter to you? Brilliant! 
and it matters because you can be a part of something truly creative. I'm Gareth, by the way. Gareth Weasley. Bit of a prodigy with potions, if I do say so myself. Pleasure to meet you. Wait, are you related to Professor Weasley? She's my aunt. Keeps too close an eye on me for comfort. Ugh. But she can't be everywhere. Listen, anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Adjurus potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will add that extra spark. I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a single Fooper feather. As you'll already be in Sharp's office with his permission, perhaps you could grab it for me. I'll get you the Fooper feather, as long as you're certain Sharp won't miss it. I assure you he won't. Fooper feathers aren't that valuable. Wait until you see what I'm brewing. Hurry back to me when you have the feather. I'll hurry back to you, absolutely, sir. Professor Sharp must have learned a lot during his time as an Auror. I wish he talked about it more. I was impressed that you were able to answer Professor Sharp's question about the Wiganwell potion. Oh, you're the new student. I've heard much about you. Um, thank you. I'm Amit, by the way. Pleasure. Amit. I love Amit. And I've never seen anyone brew such a flawless Wiganwell potion on their first try. Well done. I'm glad I was able to get it right the first time. You must simply have a knack for potion making. Some students seem so confounded by potion recipes, it's as if they're written in gobbledygook. A fascinating language, by the way. Neither here nor there, really, but I am a self-taught speaker. Merlin's beard, good conversation, is the enemy of free time. I must return my book, Gateway to the Far Stars, before my next class. Speaking of stars, we'll be in astronomy together. You'll love it. Professor Shaw is firm, but quite clever. See you soon, no doubt. Do I not get to speak to anybody? I want to talk to Ominous, but that's fine. Professor Sharp said that Wiganweld potion can treat injuries. Hope I never need it. I could have sworn Ominous had an option. Can you remind me what you needed again? Oh, that's right. I was <laughs> hoping you could get me a Fupa feather from Sharp's office. It's the last ingredient I need to complete my potion. What is Sebastian doing in the background? Odd. Alright. Your potion should not be that covered. That's in case we Why did it make that noise? This is a bad idea. At which a wizard always has a few potions on hand. Here's the food for feather you wanted. Hello, Natty. Thank you. This is going to take a moment to brew. You should get back to brewing your Adjurus potion, and I'll tell you when this concoction's finished. Yes, yes, yes. Proficiency in potions are two things that cannot be rushed. Have patience and be thorough. Okay, everybody. Once we're done with this, we'll call this a stream and also wrap it up as a YouTube video. Um, I don't know when I'm going to upload this, but I'm hoping to upload it soon. And that's odd. What's happening? Wait, it's not supposed to. Ah! Get it! Dragon Dog! What happened? <laughs> well done, Gareth. What now, Mr. Weasley? Sorry, Professor. That'll be points from Gryffindor. Again. Mr. Weasley did not do this on his own. His accomplice will answer to me as well. <laughs> like I'm watching a live action movie. <laughs> I brewed an edgerous potion, as you yeah. asked, Professor. I'm surprised you had the time. You seemed rather busy helping Mr. Weasley brew chaos. 
I'm sorry, Professor. I was merely trying to help a friend. Taking responsibility for one's actions does go a long way with me. I shall assume that you've learned a lesson. As for the work you did today at your own cauldron, I will say you've done well. I confess I was skeptical given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student. I'm glad I was able to meet your expectations. A rare occurrence. And you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet. In addition to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients, you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves. Pay particular attention in herbology. The plants you nurture there are often essential to the potions you brew here. Now, I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. That'll be all. I'm glad that you're hooked. <laughs> I think each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. Wasn't expecting that literally to blow up in my face. It was rather brilliant, though. I'd better clean up. You should finish brewing your potion if you haven't already. Is there anybody I can talk to now that class is over? No? Okay. Um, I'm glad that you're hooked. I am too. Room wants to talk to you. It's Eldritch Diggory. He used to be the Minister for Magic, I think. I love the Diggories. Ugh, my roads are going to reap from Garrus inspiration yeah. for the rest of time. It's not, it's not an urgent project. Okay, really we're not going to do that quest because I was hoping to end stream here, but I really don't want to. I love playing, so... We're not going to do Find the Missing Pages because this is a really long quest, so this is probably what I'm going to focus on, I don't know, maybe tomorrow? It depends. I'm not too sure if I'm going to stream tomorrow yet, but let's do the Dedalian Keys because we have to go all the way to the Astronomy Tower. Which I've not unlocked yet, of course. Okay, we'll do this one quest and then, for sure, I will end stream and make sure that this goes up as a YouTube video sometime in the future. The Dalian Keys, that's a long one. You need a little more for that. To, you know, complete it at least. Because I, have, I think you have to get 18 keys in the cabinets to get the tokens for the chest that's in your common room. Alright, take me to astronomy. Let me in! Alright, up we go. Up and up and up and up. And... Oh, hello. Let me in! Yay, level 15! Woohoo! Tight corners, man. Up and up and up. There was a ghost. Books. Hmm? Oh, spin. There we go. That's a really cute charm. And I don't want to knock you down. Sorry. A Dedalian key. Wonder where it might lead me. Yes, I wonder as well. I have to chase the blasted thing. Downstairs? No. Different room. Maybe? Let me in! Aha! There's okay. The How do I get this key? You have to slap it into the hole. I wish I was joking, but you gotta slap the key into the hole. That's it. <laughs> Yay. An old coin. Perhaps Nelly knows what it means. Revelio. I hear it. Oh my god, is this gonna annoy me? You are going 
to annoy me. Forget it. Oh, I'm asking for a discount. So many stairs in this place. Ugh. The last thing I want to do is get through that stuff. So many stairs! Castle is enormous. Alright, there she is. And this is where Malfoy got turned into a weasel if I Were you I able to follow one correctly. of the Dedalian keys? Yes. Hello Nelly. I managed to get a Dedalian key into its lock. Brilliant! What did you find in the cabinet? A curious token of some sort. Looks like some sort of house token. I bet it unlocks house chests. I call them house chests. I've seen the one in Gryffindor and heard they're also in the other common rooms as well. Keep an eye out. Yay. I do hope you continue on. For so much effort, the prize must be something grand. I should okay. see this through and find the Hufflepuff house chest. No, we're not going to do that. Because we are going to do that one next stream, hopefully soon. With that being said, this stream is going to be uploaded onto YouTube. So for my YouTube audience, thank you so very much for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. So please like the video if you like it, dislike it if you dislike it. Let me know in the comments down below what you would like to see from me. Next, consider subscribing and be part of the pantry and hit that notification bell so you don't miss a thing. My name is Jelly Jimmy Jam and I will see you in the next video. And I hope I see you guys in the next stream. Hopefully tomorrow I will be live, but just in case, make sure you follow me and you have your notifications on so you don't miss a thing from me. With that being said, thank you all so much for watching this stream. I hope you guys are liking this journey and I will see you guys very, very, very soon. Okay, bye everybody.